All right, hey guys, Jeff and Olivia here at Riptide K9. Today's video features Buster here, along with Miss Zero as a distraction. Buster's typically had some issues with dogs in the past, so we just want to demonstrate control in the presence of other dogs. So right now Buster's demonstrating some nice leash healing on Olivia's left hand side, maintaining pretty good position. And doing a pretty decent job at ignoring the other dog that's on the place cot here. Buster's a little bit of an older dog at seven. Just adding some structure now. I'm going to show the place command here. So place means get on the bed. Don't come off of the bed until released. Buster's allowed to sit down or stand. Once again, we've got the other dog right here next to him. As long as he keeps all four paws on the bed, he's correct. We don't care what he does. We just always keep an eye on him and then always return to him to release him. Back into a little bit of healing. Off the bed. Going for a walk. Okay, now we'll demonstrate a sit stay. So sit means sit and don't move. Olivia can back away up to the length of the leash and Buster should remain in that sit. No stay command necessary, just the word sit is fine. Heel. So now Zero and I are going to go for a little stroll here as the distraction for Buster. You can see he doesn't care. Very nice. Good. So I think we've done pretty well getting Buster under control around other dogs. He may never be that dog that can just run around free with other dogs, but having control around other dogs is super important. So that was our focus here, using this obedience to override any of that negative behavior he was able to do. So no more muzzle in the presence of another dog. Doing just fine. So that's a good look at Buster and his on-leash control. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. We'll go over everything with you when you come to pick him up. Hope you guys had a good weekend, and we'll see you soon. Take care.